What's up gamers, Jim here, and the news is already official from Stadia and Konami, but I still want to give a shout out to John Scar because they reported Super Bomberman R Online will be coming to Stadia on 1st of September. They announced this few hours before it was officially announced by Stadia and Konami. The link to that tweet will be in the description. I'm going to focus on the official description listed on the Bomberman trailer by Konami. In the description it says, Available from September 1st, Stadia Pro users will have indefinite free access to the base game. This sentence confirms that Super Bomberman R Online is the first Stadia free to play title. I've covered free to play news on Stadia being locked by Stadia Pro before. I also covered that Super Bomberman R Online could be free to play. Turns out both of them turned out to be true. Stadia never uses the words free to play because that would be a lie. You have to pay for Stadia Pro, so therefore it's technically not free to play. However, that being said, these games such as Super Bomberman R Online are basically Stadia's equivalent to what a free to play game would be like. If we continue with the description, the second line says, from September 1st to November 30th, 2020, Stadia Pro, Pro users will be able to claim the Premium Edition Bundle, which is basically the base game and Premium Pack. This right here is the normal Stadia Pro games that we claim every month. As Stadia Pro members, we can claim the Premium Edition Bundle until the end of November, and then it's ours to keep forever as long as you're subscribed to Stadia Pro. However, in the first sentence, it mentions that Stadia Pro users will have indefinite free access to the base game. This means that the base game is the free-to-play version, but it's locked behind Stadia Pro. It also says indefinite, so that means this game will stay as long as possible as a free-to-play title, but in the future there is a chance where the game can be removed for whatever reason. Again, this is something I covered one or two months ago when I found codes that were different between Stadia Pro free games and Stadia Pro claimable games. The keyword is that it says access and not claim in the first sentence, which is what I was pointing out a few months ago with the codes. Stadia Pro Free Games is basically what free to play is on Stadia. Super Bomberman R Online, the base edition, is the Stadia Pro Free Game. However, Stadia Pro Claimable Games is what we've experienced every month since launch where we claim Stadia Pro Games. Super Bomberman R Online Premium Edition Bundle is the Stadia Pro claimable game which can only be claimed up until end of November. So what if you don't have Stadia Pro? Well, you can actually purchase the base edition for $10. Which brings me to my next point. Eventually we will start seeing more and more free to play games coming to Stadia. Now we know how free to play games will work on Stadia. Let's use a random example of a popular free-to-play game. Let's use Call of Duty Warzone. If Call of Duty Warzone was to come to Stadia, it would be locked behind a Stadia Pro title, but players would be able to purchase a base edition of the game for maybe as little as $10. Thank you for watching my video, this is Jem, and I'll see you on the next one.